Hello everybody, Walkie Puppy here bringing you another Let's Play video inside of Stardew Valley. Today is the 4th of fall, yes fall, in our uh, year one completionist farm. Uh, yeah, so let's uh, <laughs> uh, let's start the day off like we always do by checking the weather. Welcome to Kosu 5, your number one source for weather, news, and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow, it's going to be clear and sunny all day. Oh, uh, okay, cool. And now let's check the fortune. Uh, Welcome back to Wellwick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you've come to the right place. The spirits are very displeased today. They will do their best to make your life difficult. Well, that's not very nice. Uh, let's check on living off the land. Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. It's blackberry season. Bushes across the countryside are overflowing with ripe fruit. Just go outside and see for yourself. Okay, so we might partake of the blackberry uh, at some point, but I do actually have a plan for today's uh, episode. Uh, so I really want to get to the next level with the coop. Um, so, and I don't have enough gold. I need 1,700-ish gold. Uh, so what I want to do to make a little bit of money today is I actually want to process all of our geodes. Now, it costs money to process geodes, and but we're also going to get a whole bunch of stuff uh, we can donate to Gunther. And all the duplicates that we get, I can go in and sell, right, to Clint? So it doesn't make a ton of money initially because you do have to donate so much of it. Uh, but it uh, it is overall profitable when you're doing a whole bunch of them together. When you're doing just one or two, then, you know, you don't have enough to, to definitely get profit. But um, with the amount that I have, it should be pro- Oh, we got a large goat's milk, didn't we? Yay! Our goat's happy with us. Oh, that's so great. Um, I do wish that I could- uh, actually can if I want to turn that into cheese, but I'm gonna save it to donate because it's our first one and it's super special and we got a pomegranate Oh, ho, 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 that's fantastic. Our apple tree is not quite ready to go yet Which is odd because I'm pretty sure I planted those at the exact same time uh, But you know, whatever that's fine. Uh, let's keep this amethyst on us um, And because we're gonna need all the inventory space we can get I'm gonna put my bucket away today uh, and the other thing I'm going to do besides geodes is I'm going to, um, what's it called? I'm going to go fishing because I think we're falling behind in our fishing skill and there is one fish that I need to get that I don't have yet. That's not fishing. Uh, where is my skills? Oh, there it is. All right. So we're level nine farming. Don't have to worry about that. We'll definitely hit 10, uh, pretty quickly. Seven combat and seven mining. Those are kind of going hand in hand because I'm, uh, leveling those up in the mines. And uh, foraging, that's totally different. But fishing, we're only at level five, so we need to we need to make up some some progress on our level five fishing. All right, so let's um let's get our bamboo pole out as well. And okay, so the game plan is I am going to run over and um, try to find Abigail, give her an amethyst, then head up to the community center. Donate these two things. Oh, I didn't grab the geodes. And then I need to grab the geodes and take those over to Clint. Uh, and then I'm going to do a little bit of fishing in the river. Uh, yep, and that's what today's episode is really going to be. And I need to get over 10,000 gold by the end of the episode. Uh, I'm going to stack the odds in my favor, though. I've got an idea to do that. This is not the right chest, is it? I was like, where are all of my geodes? They're not in here. Um, the other thing I want to do is sell some of the excess minerals I have that I'm just sitting in here doing nothing. Let's see, geode, geode. Is that all the geodes? I got normal, I got uh, frozen, I got magma, I got omni. Okay, cool. That should be all of them. Uh, I gotta, I'm gotta. i going to leave the diamond in here because that could be a good gift for somebody. I only have one frozen tier. I thought I had more of those. I wonder if I have them in another chest or something. Uh, but like I got three jade. Let's keep two. Let's keep two of those yeah let's keep two topaz and get rid of the rest right they're not worth a ton but i don't i don't need them i don't need fire quartz for anything um i keep it the amethyst because that's what we need for abigail uh oh and let's sell a ruby too so i've got a bunch of gemstones sitting in here doing nothing i'm gonna organize this because this looks completely unorganized um i don't like how that was organized oh gosh oh gosh i've got to organize these chests it's crazy it's just crazy um, we can keep the rainbow shell. I can just throw those combat boots away. They're not worth anything. Uh, I probably have bombs somewhere else too. I'll probably stack those. Is there a bomb in here? Yeah, there's bombs in here. Yes. Okay. 
Any other things I need to sell in here? Um, no, I don't think so. I am going to take the star fruit and um, put it in the 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 jamming machine. What's it called? The preserves jar. Put it in the preserves jar because uh, I don't I don't need to keep it. I can grow more later, especially after I get the um, once I get the bus and I get the access to the greenhouse. Um, yeah, that'll be good. So let's sell all this stuff that I don't want. And all this stuff is the other stuff I want to keep. Okay, so let's get going. Uh, I'm just going to peek my head up here super quick, see if I see any artifact spots. I do not. Uh, I probably should have checked the chest to see if there's anything else I could have donated to Gunther. I don't think so, because I think I cleared that out um, a couple days ago. So it should be, it should be pretty good there. Uh, let's double check the calendar real quick. And, oh, it is Elliot's birthday tomorrow. And I'm pretty sure Elliot loves pomegranate. So the next pomegranate I get tomorrow, I'll have to make sure I go and give it to him. Uh, I could really go for a rot bike I'll accept the quest, but I am not going to be able to do that for you. Oh, where am I going? Let me go in here. Uh, let's go find our gal friend, Abigail. There she is. Running off to the, to the kitchen to grab a snack. Before you grab your snack, have this gift. I seriously love this. You're the best wonky puppy. Oh, that's so nice. Last night, I dreamt that my left hand had turned into a gigantic quail. Does that mean anything? Yeah, it, it means you need to, um, you, you need to calm down. You just need to calm down. That's crazy. Why is your hand a gigantic quail? Uh, all right, now let's swing up to the community center and drop off two more things into our bundles. Oh, that's so exciting. Uh, I'm going to put the pomegranate and the artist in good bin for now. I know I also need one for the wizard on the bulletin board, but I just want to get artisan done, which I can actually do as soon as our apple tree is done. Very exciting. And then put the goat's milk in the animal bundle. And then all we need is for our chickens to start giving us nice eggs, and we need to buy a duck. And I can't buy a duck until I get to 10,000 gold today, and then upgrade my coop tomorrow, and then buy a duck the day after that, and then wait for that duck to grow up and lay eggs. <laughs> so that's going to take a little bit. But if I really want to be able to finish the greenhouse by the middle of fall, I've got to get on top of that. i uh, got to get that duck purchased really, really quickly. Um, mm, a blackberry. Very nice. Uh, though I do need to keep my inventory free, because um, I'm going to have a whole bunch of stuff going into my inventory as I break open these geodes. All right, so let's go in here and uh, let's start processing geodes. Let's do the most valuable ones first, which are the <laughs> which are the Omni geodes. And I got a little bit of copper. Fantastic. Oh, and a little bit of mud from clay. Oh, a dwarvish helmet. So that's good. Uh, sandstone. Ghost crystal? I mean, these are all things we can donate. That's good. Uh, uh, Jasper. Uh, <laughs> uh, Nikoite? Okay. So, so far, there's nothing we can really sell. Uh, so these guys aren't going to be profitable. But we are getting some gems, which is good. Um, alright, let's break open these frozen ones, I guess. A little bit of coal. A um, frozen deer. We can sell that. Some stone. Some iron. Uh, ooh, a whole bunch of coal. That's not bad. One little bit of gold. Uh, some stone. A drum. It's not going to let me do another one, is it? Nope. Okay. So let's go donate a whole bunch of stuff. And then we'll sell off the extras that we have that we can't donate. And then we'll, well, I'll probably take three or four times <laughs> of, um, of doing all this. Uh, but I mean, it's good that I'm going to put all the stuff that we get from the geodes up there. Ooh, we got a reward uh, up here. All like the gemstone mineral type things that we get from the geodes. I'm going to put on this table up here. And then like the dwarvish helmet and the drum. I'll put that in the, like the artifact table in the middle. Because I don't think those are really gems or minerals. They're like artifacts. Yeah, they're artifacts. They're Ooh, we got another reward. We got another reward. Wow, that's cool. 
All right, so that's all we can donate. Let's just look at what the rewards are. I'm probably not gonna pick them up. Oh, we got a rare crow and oh, we got the big bear. Okay, so I will want to get those at some point, but I don't want to get them right this second. Um, yeah, so let's head back in here and start this all over again. Actually, before I do it again, I'm gonna go into the shopping menu and I'm gonna sell the stuff that I don't want to keep that I got. Um, oh, that's just a frozen tear. All right, so so far we're down 300 gold. Um, so I'm hoping we start getting some duplicates soon. Ooh, obsidian. Oh, more obsidian. Uh, more obsidian. Uh, I wonder if this is glitching or something. Oh, that may not be a bad thing, because I think these are worthwhile. No, it wasn't. Okay, it just, there were just genuinely that many obsidian for some reason. Okay, that was weird. Um... Well, I, four obsidian should sell for a good amount. Oh, I'll sell the fire quartz too. And we got some gold. Ooh, and some iridium. That's really cool. I mean, we don't have enough to do anything with it, but oh, some more obsidian. And some more obsidian. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, those selling those six obsidian should be really good for us. Hopefully it's enough to make up all the gold I'm spending. I'm breaking these open. Okay, there's two more things we can donate. Uh, one more thing we can donate. <laughs> One more thing we can donate. One more thing we can donate. Oh, that's not bad. We do need to donate all of this stuff eventually, but I want to also make money today. Um, I mean, this isn't the best way to make money. I know that, but I'm hoping I can just make up like at least like 500 gold or something like that. That would be really, really great if we could actually do that. And I don't, I think if I get one more unique item, it's not going to let me break any more geodes open. Well, I mean, we got 24 bits of coal so far too. That's actually pretty worthwhile. Yeah, all right, you're done. You're done. Um, okay, so we're down a thousand gold. Oh, geez, we have to make up a lot. Uh, hopefully that obsidian and the fire quartz and all that, hopefully that helps bridge that gap at least a little bit. Um, and hopefully I start getting, I'll put the petrified slime over here. Um, I think this is a mineral. Yeah, this is a mineral. Ooh, oh, new achievement, treasure hunter. Awesome, so I guess I, got oh i'm getting all the rewards this is this is fun it's like ding 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 it's like being at a casino it's like ding 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 <laughs> everything's so happy uh okay let's um let's just check out the other rewards i got real quick oh i got another rare crow i think i got the singing zone which is kind of cool um but yeah i don't my house isn't big enough yet so i don't want to get all that stuff i want to do the house upgrades that's a one-on-one -on -one, all that Right, let's go back in here and sell some stuff. I'm really hoping this obsidian's worth a lot. Oh, it's worth 1,200. Fantastic. Okay, so now we're at a surplus. That's awesome. I'm going to sell this earth crystal. I don't really want it. Um, yeah, there we go. Okay, so now we're at, now we're up 500. That's good. Uh, but I still have a bunch more. I still have 20 more geodes to process. So let's see how we net out. Oh, I think I already donated one of those. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not sure. Um, Thunder egg. That looks new. That looks like a pile of poo. Uh, that's definitely one we got just now. So I can sell that one. Oh, I can sell that one too. I can sell that one. Uh, oh, some copper. Never turned down a little bit of copper. And a little bit of iron. And some stone. That's not cool. Definitely not worth 25 gold. Some mud. Uh, earth crystal. I'll sell that. And a little bit of copper. Give me like a whole load of obsidian again. That was cool. Uh, I think we've already donated that. Maybe not. I'm not sure. Uh, it's not going to let me process anymore. Okay. So let's go donate again. Um, and we should only need one more run of this. Okay. We're about even with where we started at the moment. And I know we have got some stuff to sell. So we should be okay. Okay. So this is new. This Malachite, I think it was. Put that there. Uh, put you here. Oh, look, we're going to fill this whole table. That's cool. I like that. Put this over here. Uh, we'll just put this pile of poo front and center on this table over there. And I think that's it. Yes, looks like that's it. Okay, cool. Uh, let's go back over here. And now I need to go sell everything else that I can sell. Back to him and just see where we're at so far. So, I mean, at the moment we're making money, which is good. We're at 8,600, so we've made 300 gold. <laughs> uh, I mean, that's not a lot, to be honest. Oh, we haven't even done the frozen geodes yet either. Okay. 
That's cool. Uh, slate. I think I've already sold those two or donated those two. I know I've donated this one. So that's sellable. I that's the pile of poo again, so I can sell the pile of poo. Hopefully the pile of poo's worth something. Let's see, a little bit of iron. Um, some coal. Frozen tear. Stone. And last thing. Stone again. Okay. Let's see if any of these are new. Let's see. No, 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 no. No. Okay, so all those are ones I already got. We can we we'll just sell everything. Sell you, sell you. Sell you, sell you, sell you. Okay. <gasps> oh, and I ended up at 8,800. So that means we made 500 gold doing this. This was actually pretty worthwhile. That's cool. And we got a whole bunch of ores on top of that. I'm just going to do this so I can organize it. And some stone. I don't really care about that. And a little bit of clay. don't really care about that. But we got 27 pieces of coal, 7 copper, 3 iridium, 20 iron, 5 gold. We got a whole bunch of stuff. Don't do the museum. Bunch of rewards and achievement and made 500 gold. So I think that was worthwhile. That was a good way to spend some time. Uh, I was just worried about that costing us money. And I uh, did a little bit of research and just to kind of see what the average return rates were for geodes. And I um, was really hoping that I could come out ahead because I knew I had to donate a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, but it, it, my, my fears didn't come true. We actually made money. We made a lot of progress. So that, that was really worthwhile. That was a lot of fun too. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, but for now, what I want to try to get is the tiger trout. That is the fish that I'm missing. I'd also like to just catch as many fish as I can so I can sell them. Because I still need to make up a couple hundred gold. I think with everything I've put in the bin from artisan goods and, um, uh, gemstones and all that. Oh, there it is. Tiger trout. Nice. Um, I should be able to make up the 1200 that I need. But I definitely don't want to get to a point where I've only got, like, um... I've got like 9,800 and I'm missing 200 gold to go and complete the upgrade. And honestly, even after we do the upgrade, we'll be broke again. So um, it would be good to just kind of get as much money as I can because I know I'm about to make a really big purchase. Uh, just as kind of uh, some sort of a, a safety net or a nest egg so I can um, not be totally broke all the time. That would be good. <laughs> Um, I'm kind of considering looking up and down the river real quick and seeing if there's a, a bubbly spot I can go to increase my catch rate because I still don't have a better pole. I haven't invested in a, um, in, in a, in a better fishing pole, but that's okay. Um, cause really I'm still putting every, every little bit of gold that I make into the stuff I need to complete the community center. So everything is, um, everything is being reinvested. There's nothing... I'm doing right now that's for fun <laughs> or um, yeah so I'm not even investing in tool upgrades which I do really need to do still too but I just um, it's just not a priority at the moment there's just way too much to do oh that one was a perfect catch nice that'll be good fishing experience these salmon look so tasty I like salmon salmon's real tasty here we go another fish and, um, yeah, so I know this game get a little bit boring. Hopefully, me chattering away is uh, at least somewhat of uh, an entertaining thing to listen to. But, um, really, my goal for this episode... Oh, and this is going to be episode because I'm planning on uploading this one on a Saturday. Um, my plan for this episode is to get enough gold to upgrade my coop tomorrow and then go and do the coop upgrade tomorrow. So, hopefully, we get to see all of that in one continuous thing. And then uh, the next episode, I'll have to actually go and buy a little quack quack. My little duck friends. Um, I should switch. Oh, there it is. Um, I should check and see. Oh, what was that noise? There's a treasure chest. I really want it too. Let's see. Treasure, 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 treasure. Oh, come on, come on, come on. This is a really easy fish. It's just sitting there. I wish it was sitting closer to the treasure chest, but it was just sitting over there. Um, we still haven't found a dinosaur egg, which would be really cool. Oh, that's another thing I can donate to Gunther, though. That's nice. Gunther's just going to be, like, really happy with me today, <laughs> giving him all kinds of stuff. Um, yeah, I don't remember what I was saying. Oh, we haven't found a, di a dinosaur egg yet, which normally I find those when I'm fishing. Um, I fish them up in treasure chests, 
Uh, but it'd be really cool to get one of those because I can throw them once I upgrade the um, once I upgrade the coop. I can throw it in the incubator and hatch that to get a little dinosaur friend that'll lay dinosaur eggs all the time. And the next one I can uh, donate to Gunther. Oh, we got two amethysts. That's awesome. That sets us up for an entire week of gifting to Abigail. And we got some bait, which we can't use yet because we haven't bought an upgraded rod quite yet. Um, yeah, the dinosaur egg is one of the rarer things to find. Uh, normally I find the dinosaur egg where I find the ancient seed. Just in when I'm playing, because I think ancient seeds are even rare. But um, yeah, not not this time. Uh, we're finding all kinds of chests too, and I got two more geodes, so I might just oh, Clint's closed, isn't he? Yeah, he closes at four. That's annoying. Um, well, I'm gonna donate while I'm right over here. I'm gonna donate the thing that I have to donate to him while I'm thinking about it, just to clear out a little bit of inventory space too. Uh, where did I put the other skeleton parts? Oh, I don't have any skeleton parts other than this yet. Oh, yeah, I do. They're down here. I'll put it right here, then. Ooh, a new reward. What's my reward? Um, oh, a bear statue. Nice. Hopefully, we're getting close to enough things donated that uh, we get access to the sewer, because that's how that works. Um... If you get enough artifacts, then eventually Gunther gives you a key to the sewer as a thank you for being so amazing. So, uh, and that would be really cool because then we can go meet uh, the guy that lives in the sewer, which we got a little bit of a preview to earlier in uh, the series. We had a cutscene with Jazz and stuff. Yes, eat the algae. And then I'm just going to slowly start making my way up here. I'll start fishing off of this bridge. And then um, that way I'm like in line to go and donate the the thing. The tiger trout. Not really donate, but put it into the bundles. I guess it's donating to the Juminos. Junimos? The Junimos. Is, is it Jumino? I, oh, I never know if it's Jumino or Junimo. But I don't think it really matters either. <laughs> um, but give it to the, the Junimo bundles. That'll actually, I think, be the end of the river fish that I need to get. And that'd be fantastic. Ooh, new record on a smallmouth bass. Uh, I think it was a perfect catch, too. Awesome. And uh, a perfect catch gives you a little bit extra fishing experience, if you don't know that. And I think it boosts the quality of the fish a, a, a bit. Like the... I don't know exactly how it decides what quality your fish is when you, when you pull it up. I know it's based on your fishing skill. Uh, but I think if you get a perfect catch, it also kind of nudges it upwards a little bit on the scale. <laughs> this is a difficult one. So I think it might be a tiger trout. Oop, oop, oop. Oop, oop, oop. Yeah, this is uh, probably a tiger trout. Man, I wish my fishing skill was better so my bar would be bigger. <laughs> uh, that one got away. Oh, well. They probably stopped coming out at 7 because I think that's when it switches officially to night fishing. Um, and then I'm probably going to be getting bream for a minute. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to keep fishing for probably the rest of today. And like I said, go and upgrade the coop tomorrow. Um, thinking about what else we need to do for the community center, the only like real thing that is still uh, kind of a problem and outstanding for this is a... Um, what's it called a red cabbage which i really don't have a way to get other than the gypsy wagon so i'll definitely have to make sure i go and talk to the traveling merchant um every single time that she or he i don't know i think it's a she every time she rolls in the town uh, i got some more bait fantastic more bait we can't use i'll just throw it in the chest which is kind of nasty if you think about it yeah so i gotta just really 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 cross my fingers and hope that we get a red cabbage from the merchant. That's really the only thing that's going to keep me from completing the the center in um in year one, the community center. Yo, got another fish on the line. This one's pretty timid, so it's probably going to be a salmon again. Uh, no, it's bream. So we switched over to night fishing. Uh, bream are pretty docile, but I think they're worth a fair amount, and they're really pretty. They have really pretty fins. I like I like that. Um, they're cool. This is going to be another bream, I think. But hopefully all of these fish... Nope, it's a smallmouth bass. Hopefully catching all these fish gives me a nice little gold boost as well. Um, that's really the reason to do it. 
I'll eat this algae just to get it out of my inventory. And I'm going to throw this trash away too because I don't have a recycling machine yet or anything. Uh, once I get a, a recycling machine, I'll keep that stuff and just go throw it in uh, the recycling machine. Like That would have been a bit of coal, most likely, um, coming out of the recycling machine. Yeah, uh, if you're not familiar with, re with recycling machines, um, you can throw in the trash that you get from garbage cans and fishing into those and you get useful items. Not super valuable items, of course, I threw it away and it came right back. Not super valuable items, but useful items normally. Like, um, I think if you put in coal, I'm sorry, trash, you normally get coal. If you put in driftwood, you normally get regular wood back or torches maybe too. And for newspaper, if you put that in, you can get torches or you can get uh, cloth, which is nice because cloth sells for a good amount. Um, and the other thing you can put in is broken CDs and broken glasses. I normally get refined quartz back out when I put those in. So again, it's pretty worthwhile. It, it, you do get useful stuff. So definitely worth doing. I think I get a recycling machine from one of the Jumino bundles as well, but I don't remember which one it is. Um, maybe one of the bulletin board ones? This sounds right. <laughs> but, you know, I'm also making it up. I think I've broken the record on smallmouth bass like four times this fishing experience, or this fishing expedition too. So, that's good, I guess. Um, means I should be getting higher quality fish, which should sell for a premium. Pretty good. I really hope I can get my fishing skill up a notch this time too otherwise it's kind of feels like you're wasting your time you're not because you're still progressing and going further up the skill tree but it just it just is so disappointing when you don't go up <laughs> the next level and um i think the last time i fished i went up a level so there's probably a pretty good chance that i don't level up it would just be really really crappy <laughs> if i didn't go up oh i'll say let's see what we get now uh, we got to fishy. This feels like a bream to me. Perfect. Nope, another small last bass. I don't know what I'm talking about. There we go. He looks so cute in his glasses. My little character. A little straw hat and his glasses and his heart t-shirt. <laughs> so living the life, guys. Living the life. There we go. And perfect. Nice. Got another bream. Not going to complain. And it's getting to 11 o'clock. I'll probably push this to 11.30 and then run up to the community center, run back to the farm, throw the fish in the bin, throw the minerals in the mineral chest, and then um, call it a night. I want to get in bed before 1 so I don't get in trouble. Or I don't get an, an energy penalty. I don't, I don't get in trouble. Uh, so I don't get an energy penalty. Okay, so I didn't catch anything else. It's 1140. I'm going to call it. Okay, so we got, overall, we got the tiger trout, which we needed for the center. We got eight normal quality smallmouth bass. We got five normal quality salmon. Two silver quality bream. And one silver quality smallmouth bass. So it's not overall bad. We got a lot of fish. No, I don't want to eat that. I know it's getting late. Don't tell me that. You feel like you're being passive aggressive. All right, we only got one tiger trout, so it's a really good thing we caught that one first. Uh, but we finished that bundle, and what do we get? We got some bait. <laughs> Great, more bait. Um, okay, let's head down and go back home. It's already twelve ten. Oh geez. Um, yeah, I pushed that probably a little bit further than I should have, but that's okay. We'll we'll make it. It'll be okay. Um, let's head out this way, and I gotta remember to get. The pomegranate for uh, Elliot's birthday, and I want to take an amethyst to Abigail tomorrow for gifting. All right, here's this. Let's put you guys in here. Don't need to keep the fish for nothing. Yeah, I do need the gold. Um, anything else I want to sell? No. I am going to here real quick and put one of those away. I'm not keeping fishing stuff in there. I guess I'll put the geodes away. I'm going to put all this away. The stone and the mud. And I don't know where I put bait. Not in there. It must be in here. I really got to go. Yeah, I'm up to 110 bait, though. Just finding it. It's kind of funny. 
Uh, yeah, I got some algae in there, so I'll put that in there. Okay, let's run, 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 run to bed. Run, 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 run to bed. Ah, oh, we made it right before one. Awesome. Come on, fishing. Come on, fishing. Ah, oh, we didn't get the level. Oh, that's disappointing. Okay, so from farming goods, I got 700 gold. Okay, and from fishing, we got 1,200 gold, so that was worthwhile. And another 1,200 mining. So overall, 3,000 gold. We needed about 1,200, so we're good. We, we made it up. And that fishing gave us almost all of what we needed. Uh, the artisan goods and clearing out some of my minerals uh, definitely brought that home. So we're looking good to go and upgrade the coop today. Er, 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 er. Okay, so now it's day five. Let's start the day off by checking the weather. Welcome to Kosu 5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Fan! Fantastic. Okay, let's check the fortune teller. Welcome to Wellwix Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you've come to the right place. The spirits are very displeased today. They will do their best to make your life difficult. Another day of bad luck. Fantastic. Uh, oh, and we got some stuff done. Oh, we got an apple done, too. Oh, I'm so excited to see that. Um, let's pick these here. Sunflowers. And I'm probably going to plant them again because we got a whole bunch of seeds from that, too. Which is really cool. Uh, we got a little bit of corn done. I don't think anything else is done, though. Um, I haven't encountered any crows yet. Well, that's good to know. I think these are the cranberries down here. Oh, we got a whole bunch of pumpkins. Nice. Uh, all right, let's plant the sunflowers here, 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 here. Oh, exactly. We harvested and got the same amount of seeds. So that almost never happens. And I'm going to throw this corn in there, too, because I don't really want it. Um throw this up here just because it looks messy <laughs> uh where did i put my milk pail did i put it in here i normally just keep it on me because you know i'm lazy but uh i didn't do that last time because i wanted all the inventory space i could get uh all right there we go we got some stuff to sell Ooh, that was a gold quality cheese i got a big old milk from my big old cow all right milk the cow talk to the chicken hello piggy he's still not grown up how close are you to growing up a month. He's got to be getting close. Maybe tomorrow. Let's see. Where's my goat? And I just need my goat. Is he in here? Yeah, he's in here. I don't think I can milk you today, right? Yeah, you don't have milk today? No milk. Okay. That's fine. Uh, so let's grab our eggs. And uh, we'll need to process those. Uh, still no big eggs. How are they feeling, though? How are you feeling? Looks really happy. Okay, so you should be going up in hearts. Where's the white chicken? You should be like exactly the same, right? Yeah. Exactly the same. Because we bought them on the exact same day. We give them the exact same treatment. They should be behaving exactly the same way. Very good. Uh, okay, dokie. Let's also go over here. And throw that stuff in the back. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, so we got a... It's Friday. So, actually, before I go down this way, uh, or before I go into town, I'm actually going to go down to the forest and check the traveling merchant because I don't want to forget that. That would really suck if I forgot it. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got some pine tar down there. That's nice. Um, oh, they got some trees growing over here, which I'm definitely not going to chop them down because I could definitely use the trees. It looks like we have an extra tree here. This means this one should have a pine tar too. Yeah, it does. Cool. I forget what you need pine tar for as a crafting item. Um, yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> uh, all right, let's head over here and see our friend, the traveling merchant. These trees are all about to grow up too, which is nice because I am totally out of trees to chop down. Uh, hello. Oh, a ling cod. Um, I don't need that for... I need that for completionists, but I don't need that for um, the thing. What's it called? The community center. So I'm not going to buy it. Uh, nope, I'm good. Thanks for all your hard work, traveling merchant. But bring a red cabbage next time. What's wrong with you? Um, ooh, I think these sell for a good amount. Oh, they're dead. Let's do that. I'm going to chop down to wood while I'm here. Just because I want the... Um, What's it called? I want the foraging XP. And after I upgrade the thing, the coop with Robin, I might 
just go mining. I know I've got really bad luck, but I only need to cover five levels to get to the bottom of the mine, and it should be really cool to get to the bottom of the mine. Uh, I got a couple of mushrooms I can sell. Uh, not valuable mushrooms, but still mushrooms nonetheless. Let's chop down this guy. Chop down this guy. And head on out! Uh-oh, there's a slime down there. Sneaky, sneaky slime. Uh, okay, so I'm really happy that these trees over here are in their final stage before they become big. Uh, because I've been getting worried about how I'm going to get more wood. Oh, and speaking of, I never grabbed my wood and my stone to go and upgrade my coop. I need to get my head in, my head in this. Come on. Me. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and I'm not, I'm letting, I'm letting trees grow up on my farm, by the way, in case you guys are wondering why I'm not clearing them off. Uh, because I do really need the wood. And, um, yeah, here we go. Wood and stone, I think is what I need to bring. As well as my cash money. Uh, here we go. Mushroom, 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 mushroom. And let's throw the hardwood and the pine tar in a chest. And I've got all, oh, you got pine tar in here, that's fine. Like, I've got it all kind of spread out weird. I don't have, um, I don't really have this organized very well. But we know that. <laughs> we know that. Uh, and I don't want to spend a bunch of extra gold building more chests. Or not gold, uh, wood. Because I'm so low on wood. It's just this, this vicious cycle I keep getting stuck in. I don't like it. Alright, let's hope Abigail's home. What's going on here? I need Earth Crystal to rub on my sore legs. Please bring one ASAP. 150G, Lewis will be happy. So if I think about it, I'll do it. If I've got time. Um, I'm not going to make it a priority, though, because, you know, Lewis seems like a jerk. Here you go. I seriously love this. You're the best, wonky puppy. Awesome. We're going to hang out in the saloon this evening. It's kind of like a Friday tradition, I guess. Okay, let's see how we're doing socially with Abigail. Maru's still better. Um, but she's, uh, she's up to four hearts, which is nice. Um, okay, so let's, uh, go see if we can't find... S not Sebastian, Elliot. Super quick. Hopefully he's out of his house. Because, um, if he's not out of his house, there's really no way... Oh, there he is. Perfect. Let's give him this pomegranate for his birthday. No, don't eat the pomegranate, you silly goose. A birthday gift? That's very kind of you. I love it. Fantastic. So happy you love it. Let's see what that did for our relationship with him. Well, that took him all the way up to three hearts. We haven't given him a single thing. We've only talked to him a little bit here and there. And that gave us a ton of points with him, which is fantastic. We still haven't found a cockle down here, which is pretty annoying. Um, if I don't find one soon, I'm just going to have to throw a crab pot into on a, onto my farm and see if I can't get something that way. You got a bit of coral. Now, all this is good to sell to. Uh, yeah, so now let's head up to Robin and do our upgrade. I'm actually starting to kind of run out of time, so I need to need to make that a priority and go straight up there. Um, I was going to stop off the, at the community center, but I'm not going to have time to do that. But I really want to complete that bundle today, so we are going to complete that bundle today for sure. Because uh, that's the Artisan Bundle. That's normally one of the hardest ones to do. Um, but yeah, I made some strategic ingest, uh, ingestments, uh, investments early on so I can not run into an issue with it. Which I'm very happy at how they're working out. Alrighty. Oh, whoa. Scared me. Uh, haha, there we go. Let's do a Construct Farm Building. We want a big coop. That's exactly what we want. So we need 150 stone, 400 wood, and 10,000 gold. Yes! So with this, we get the ability to get ducks, we get the incubator, and that's it, I think. And um, extra space, so we can have um, twice the number of animals. Okay, I'll start working on your cube upgrade first thing tomorrow morning. Perfect! Uh, I don't think there's anything I want to sell to you, no. And I'm down to 1,800 gold again. Hooray! Um, and that's okay. Do I, I don't think I'm going to have time to go mining now that I think about it. Um, but what I might do is just pop into the various 
floors and just get grab some minerals and stuff like that. No, I'm going to go for it. If I'm going to go mining, I'm going to go for it. See if I can get those the last five levels. I probably can't, uh, but I am going to at least go for it. Oh, I don't want to go over here. I want to go over here. Um, up here. That's where I want to go. I'm going to donate an apple into the artisan goods. Bam. And the bundle's complete. Oh, it feels so good to have this one done. Uh, and we get a keg. Very nice. I don't have the resources to build kegs yet, so that's good. Um, relatively soon, we should be getting a pumpkin and an eggplant, so we can donate those and finish that one out. And then for the animal bundle, um, again, relatively soon, we should be getting a large brown egg, a large white egg, and then once the coop upgrade's done, I can get a duck. And uh, ducks don't have different size of eggs, so as soon as it becomes old enough to lay an egg, I'll be able to get that. And then this whole thing will be done and we'll get the greenhouse. Oh, it'll be so great. Let's check in on the pantry too, because uh, this is another one. Okay, so I can't really finish this one until winter anyway, because I can't get those guys. Um, yeah, and then the construction bundle, I can I can make that one happen anytime I need to. Um, it's just there's no real point in rushing it until I can complete the winter one, right? That's my thought process, anyway. Um, okay, so what I want to do is go straight to the mines just to save some time. But, uh, yeah, if, if I'm going to go for it, I just have to go for it. I mean, I don't have a lot of inventory room, which is a bit of a problem. But uh, I should have dropped my fishing pole off, too. I should have done a lot of things different. <laughs> I don't have any food. Okay, I'm not really prepared to do this, but I want to go for it anyway. This is not going to go well. Just giving you guys a warning now, but I want to go for it. Oh, that was so worth it. Look at these diamonds. This is at least 1,500 gold right here. Hopefully I can get a double. Oh, I did. That was 1,500 gold by itself. Oh, if I get a second double, I'm just going to be giddy. And it's not going to happen, but if it did, I'd be so happy. Yeah, okay, so that was uh, 750 times 3, whatever that works out to. What, 2250? Something like that? Uh, but it's at least 2,000 gold just from that, which is fantastic. Uh, just from popping my head into the mine. Man, I'm this is so worth it now. I was going in here like, oh, this is dumb. I'm not going to get what I want, and I'm not going to blah, 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 blah. I was getting into my head and being all unhappy about it. And see, now I'm just, no matter what, this is a productive trip now. No matter what. <laughs> just for that gold alone. And ugh, we didn't get any ladders. That's annoying. So now i got to start doing this. I didn't get a bomb, did I? Oh, that would have been really great if I had gotten a bomb. Uh, so now we got to start breaking rocks. And this is where I get into trouble. Because my pickaxe is is uh, potato for these these uh, level of rocks. And it just takes way too many hits per rock to, to get down. And my luck is so bad that the, la the drop rate of ladders is going to be really bad too. So, not ideal. Actually, it's 530. Yeah, I, I feel... This has been a successful run already because of those diamonds. So what I want to do, I'm actually just going to go out and pop into another level and see if there's any valuable minerals and stuff on kind of like this first level. Um, oh, I'll get that gold. Uh, and then I'll just pop into a different level. Leave the mine. Uh, so let's go down to 115. Like, that was stupid lucky to find those diamonds like that for where my luck level is right now. But yeah, I just wanted to respawn this level and see if I can't luck out and get a ladder from an enemy. Ooh, a door squirrel. That might be one I don't have yet. I'm not sure. Let's see. Oh, it is! Nice! <laughs> uh, so that's another, like, really successful thing to get. Because uh, I think we only need one more dwarf scroll now. Now, once we get that, we can um, we can get the dwarf translation guide and go and meet the dwarf. And right now, we can get over to him if we want to with a bomb, but um, yeah, that we can't uh, can't understand what he says, so not super helpful. Let's see. Oh, we got a little bit of gold. That's not bad. I feel like that, that slime's judging me over there. And a bat's coming. Fantastic. I'm just going to sit here and swipe. <laughs> there we go. Haha! -ha! Snuck up on you. I'm not too worried about that bat wing. 
I'm just gonna get this little bit of this gold. Dodged you, bro. Oh, not gonna be able to dodge that. <laughs> there we go. Run! Okay, cool. Let's leave the mine, and uh, let's pop down to like 10... Let's do 115 again. Might as well keep spawning that level. I feel like I've got a connection with this level because of the diamonds that it gave me. Oh, that was a hoe. Oh, there we go. Ladder. Nice. Um, oh, another diamond. Yay! Oh, man. We're going to make so much money off of diamonds this time. Man, if this gave me a twofer, I'd just be happy. Come on, twofer. Oh, we got two more. That's insane! Uh, I'll get this this topaz. It's not worth anywhere near as much, but go for it anyway. Uh, is there anything I don't care for? I don't care about one little bit of fiber. I don't care about that one little bit of sap either. Um, let's just break these open just in case we can get a ladder super quick. They don't take too much effort to break. Uh-oh, we got bats. This is actually going to be good for my combat experience, so I'm actually going to stay and fight them. Now I'm going to be right here. In case my uh, health gets too low, then I'll just run up the ladder. Super quick. There we go. And pop, 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 pop. I just have a pile of bat wings around me like a badass. <laughs> oh, watch the health. Watch the health. Give me a ladder. Okay, I'm going to dump this one little bit of sap and get pick up ten. Bat wings, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, all right, let's break this and break this. Uh, do I have a couple swings left in me? I do. Okay. No ladder. Okay. <laughs> all right, now let's head out. Uh, I'll switch to the sword just so I don't accidentally exhaust myself. Uh, let's leave the mine and let us head home. Let's go to the bus stop. Let's go to the mall. <laughs> Uh, okay, I am going to sell all of those glorious diamonds and just, just go swimming in gold like Scrooge McDuck. Um, what else do I want to sell? I want to sell the clams. I want to sell the topaz. And I think that's that's it. Okay, oh, nope, there's an oyster. Okay, uh, let's see if we got enough time to just throw these monster parts away and some other stuff that I don't care to keep on me. Uh, monster parts. Um, don't care about this stuff, but it needs to go into a different chest. Uh, okay, it's a Gunther Dwarf Scroll. And the reason I'm keeping these around here is because these are actually good gifts for the dwarf, too. So, that's why. Um, anything in here? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Um, then all this stuff in here. Uh, I could probably just pop this keg down over here and start something on, what's it called, on brew? <laughs> uh, I've got so much stuff to brew, too, that I just kept. I think I put them maybe in this one. Um, yeah, let's start with the hops. The hoppy, hoppy, hoppy hops. A pale ale, because I think I still need to give a pale ale to Pam. All right, 11 o'clock. It's a little early, but we're out of energy and out of stuff to do so let's just yeah let's go ahead and go to sleep for the night let's see what we get no levels up which is a little disappointing oh we got two thousand from uh farming i came from our sunflower our corns and our artisan goods and then almost a thousand nine hundred from foraging that's all these mushrooms coral clams etc and then 3900 from of which 3750 came from these five diamonds Ah, oh, that's insane. So we made back 6,900 gold. So we we should have enough for a duck, I think. Because I think ducks are like 8,000 maybe? Maybe maybe less. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I am going to go ahead and wrap this video up here. Um, if you liked the video, please leave a, leave a like below to let me know that. I hope you did like it. And don't forget to subscribe to stay up to date with everything going on in the channel. Until next time, I will see you all in the next video. Bye!